so Gina and I were able to find a way off that bridge. Uh, we had to walk down a bunch of roads over like another bridge. And now we're here uh, and there's a lot of people that are have kind of assembled to watch the protest that we were just in the middle of from a distance. Um, so if I can get the camera over here, maybe we can get a view of what they're looking at. See the police? They've got dump trucks that are blocking off the road just in case the protesters would try to make a move. Uh, we've got officers here, a gentleman with binoculars. And there's our group that we were just down in the middle of. Uh, and then the line of police kind of holding them back. So we still don't know how this thing's going to end. We didn't know if we were going to find a way out, Gene. Let's go. What were you thinking when we were boxed in like that? I was just thinking we are going to get hit, maced, hit in the head with something, run over people. Yeah, and, and we still don't know for sure how that protest is gonna is gonna end up. Um, so we had uh, we had no choice. We had to get back. We have a deadline for our evening news, and we had to find make sure that we could find a way back to the Excel Center to write our story. So we're gonna keep obviously monitoring. You know what happens with the protest. Uh, so far, we've seen a few arrests, but police haven't had to fire that uh, tear gas. Thank goodness, or those rubber uh, bullets that they had with them, and. Uh, news choppers overhead, television live trucks, everybody just kind of waiting to see what will happen and so are we.